Jen and Justin's wedding, how was it? Great time, a lot of fun, great couple, love her, love him. Love him, great guy, really great guy. Did you know it was a wedding or did you of think Of course I knew it was a wedding. I'm not go I wouldn't have gone for a birthday party. Rumor is this is your last season, you want to move to Florida to spend more time with Beth, what's going on? Uh, I mean, listen, I'm working, I, you know, I, I've been uh, working nonstop for a, a long time. You know, doing radio, and I've done film, and I've done television. I've done a lot of different things. I've written books. And, you know, um, when I first took this job, I thought, well, I'll do it for a year because it would be funny to see me on a network-friendly television show that kids watch. And then you rocked it. And, but it was fun. It was different. But I, I never expected to do it more than a year or two. And NBC has been very gracious to me, very nice. And so they made it easy for me. They did the show out of New York. So I hung in for four years, but they asked me in July what I wanted to do, and I was honest. I said, it's enough for me. Let somebody else come in and carry uh, carry the torch. So this is it. This is it. My last hurrah. You got a favorite so far? I have a couple of favorites, actually. I think we have, we say it every year, but I think we have an incredible season of talent. I'm shocked how much talent there is out there. Now i got to ask you, what are your thoughts on Trump and all that's going on? I've always found Trump to be the most entertaining person. He called me privately and I said, what are you doing? Like, why would you mess up your perfect life? You ever been down to that place, Mar-a-Lago? It's better than Camp David. It's better than any White House. I don't even know why he needs trouble. Um, you know, but he's into it. He likes doing it. And I think people are responding to his uh, brash uh, way of speaking.